Hi, and welcome to 3dmotive.com. My name is Stephen G. Wells, and I'm a senior 3D artist. In this introduction to Keyshot 7, we're going to first take a look at the interface in Keyshot, how to create simple objects, how to move them around, how to scale them. We'll look at the different palettes. We'll look at materials and how we can easily drag and drop them onto objects to, of course, change how they look in the scene. We'll look at adjusting our environment lighting so that we can see what sort of effects that can have on the model. We'll then take a look at the model we're going to export from ZBrush itself. It's about 28 million polygons. We'll look at creating emissive lights because, of course, the spaceship is going to have lights. We want to make several different varieties of colors. We'll then take a look at a UV'd model and how we can actually add the textures into a simple material and, of course, add in the emissive as we need to. We'll look at dropping this particular model into an environment and we'll even look at adjusting the lighting in the environment so we can get the best effect on the model. We'll then finally, of course, take our model from ZBrush and we'll use the key, key shot bridge to get it into Keyshot so we can set up our final renders with the material on it, uh, set up to look just the way we want to. All right, let's get started.